rappers, uh, DJs, artists, promoters, entertainers. Stop saying support. Stop it. Stop saying support. All right. So what do I mean by that? I don't mean that you should try to ban uh, a common English word from your vocabulary entirely, but I do mean stop using it in the in the context that I, I most often see it used on, on social media. You generally uh, see it used by, you know, hobbyists like, my, like myself. This is not something you see professional promoters say very often. Not very successful ones. There's a reason for that. And that's because it's not very effective. It's the wrong way to promote. I'm going to try to explain to you why. I'll, I'll start out with a confession. I would say about 75% of the shows I've gone to uh, over the last four months or so, I, I wasn't going necessarily because I thought I was going to have a good time. Oftentimes I did have a good time, but it wasn't why I went. Um, that wasn't what got me away from YouTube and Netflix and out of my house into the you know possibly cold to go to a venue and be at this show. I did that because I, I suppose you could say, was supporting. That's because I am a, an actual member of, of the, the hip-hop scene here in Chicago. That means that the shows that I go to, the, the people performing there, you know, um, they're not just like people that I follow as artists, though a few of them are. They're not just my friends. They're my cohort. I'm participating in this thing. We have a common goal. I kind of, I kind of want to see everything that happens on the on the scene. You know, if I had infinite time, I would probably go to a show every night. I go to one to three a week, and I'm pretty easy target to promote to, I suppose, because you know, if I get a Facebook invite, and maybe a Facebook or a text message saying, "Hey, you know, we got this thing, we got this thing tomorrow. Be great to see you." Eh, I mean, fifty fifty, I'm gonna go. Because, you know, this stuff's my hobby. Like, throwing and going to shows is, is my primary hobby. Awesome, but let me tell you something. I am not your target audience. I am in the supporter group. It's pretty easy to get us, this, this very small but stable group of people, to uh, come around to your shows. But we are not a fan base. And no amount of marketing to just the artists and the promoters in your area is going to make you have a fan base. You have to get out and reach real people. <laughs> so how do you do that? Well, you have to start thinking like a normal human being. And a normal human being understands that the relationship of entertainer and entertained is not that the entertained public has the obligation to support the entertainer. That's not what we're here to do. We're here to make them happy. And if we do a good enough job of that, then they might inadvertently support us by having so much goddamn fun. That's our job. The burden is on us to make them want to attend it is not on them to support us. And I think the only time you should say things like come out and support, you know, as the primary call out is if you're a charity. If you're running at some kind of charity event, then it makes perfect sense. Sam, I am at the MC's can food drives, you know, Boys and Girls Club, things like that. The word support makes sense in that context to a normal person. But when you say things like that and you're just another guy with a SoundCloud link, it's kind of bewildering. I think it turns off people who aren't already really close to you. It's not going to win more people. Instead, talk about why don't you come out and have fun, you know? <laughs> Just talk about all the all the great things that are going to happen in the show. Push the product that you and everyone else has, has worked so hard for. Um, great music, good fun, good vibes, whatever, whatever you want to whatever you want to say. But think about it from their point of view, not just like they will have the privilege of helping the scene struggle on for another night. You know, keep the scene going. It's, it's a fine thing to say, but it's not a call out, a primary call out to normal people. The time I like to say the word support is at the end, like afterwards, either, you know, at, at the event, uh, talking to people who came. Hey, you guys came out. Thanks for the support. Uh, thank people for the for support, you know, after you've already done something for them and let, and let them know that, you know, what what they did really, really meant something to you, too. But, uh, you know. That's not going to be what motivates the transaction. As, uh, as Kelly Betts used to tell me, every word counts. 
I'm DJ Pompey of the No Coast Battle League. Also, shout out our uh, affiliate, Skull and Mike Entertainment, down in Columbia, Missouri. Thank you for listening. I've just got a few more of these uh, blogs I want to get off my... Uh, my brain, you know, let me know in the comments what else you'd like to hear about. Anything about uh, rap battling, organizing, promoting, DJing, MCing, production. You know, I don't know everything, but I'll tell you what I do know and I'll tell you who knows more. Let me know what you'd like to hear about. If I use your idea, I'll send you a free download link to my album Reinventing the Wheel and I'll shout you out in the next episode. That's all I got right now, guys. Thanks for the support.